this thing is essentially a garden in a box, okay? So what it does is like you can put it anywhere in your house. You don't even need to worry about like lighting or anything because it has its own lights and it, like the little pods where the seeds come in like grow on their own. It's just like magic. And supposedly like you just cannot ruin this. So since we both are not good at planting, we thought that we'd test it out. So let's see what's in the box. Do you think it's gonna work? Um, I think, I've seen a lot of videos on it and it seems to work, so I trust the videos. Don't trust everything you see online, but I, I have faith. I feel like everything DIY, which like there's stuff provided for you so it's not 100% DIY, but like you're still doing the labor, if we wanna call it that. And I think anything DIY is just like never gonna come out as good as you think it's gonna come out. day seven since we have planted our beautiful little plant babies and we wanted to give you guys an update. I honestly have no idea how long it takes lettuce to grow, you know? Nope. No? Well, it's like you're supposed to sprout in one to two weeks, so this is exactly seven days and the first sprout we had was this one. Yep. And it sprouted on day four and it's already this big. Like the leaves are getting bigger. These were the leaves before. And look how big this one has come. Checking on the plant babies today. Check out that lettuce. Grew so much over the holiday weekend. And then it looks like the basil, these guys look like they're ready to come out of the capsules. So they're like kind of pushing up against it, if you can see right there. And then we have the tomato plants over here. I'm super excited to see them have actual tomatoes growing on them. This water filler situation is almost back to the bottom, so you can see I can press all the way down, which means it's about to run out of water again. So I'm gonna refill it and see what happens. Guys, we've seen the first tomato. Everything is pretty much done growing. We're just waiting on this little guy. I have been told that there are now two red tomatoes. There's one here, one here. There's actually a tiny one turning orange here. Final thoughts. What do you think, Maggie? Is it worth it? Uh, for me it is because I got a lot of satisfaction out of like coming into the office and like running my little legs over and saying, seeing like all the growth that they've gone through. I'm like, oh my god, there's lettuce there. I think it's not completely foolproof, so just keep an eye on the water tank. It might not be exactly 30 days. I think definitely for the price, um, you could get like a lot of fresh produce year round and not really have to take that much care of it, which is nice. Um, it's also like nice to have some green stuff in your home that you are like caring for and growing. So I definitely think it's worth it.